group of people affected by Friday's flooding in Boardman showed up at tonight's trustees meeting wanting solutions to the problems. They want help paying for the damage, which they may not get. And they also want a plan to make sure it doesn't happen again, which they may get. Pleading for help is our top story at 11. So, uh, Joe Burton lives on Boardman's Arlene Drive, which on Friday night after the rain hit was knee deep in water. And I can't continue to clean up poop water up to my stomach. Burton was one of 15 people who spoke at this evening's Boardman Township Trustees meeting, people whose basements were flooded and who wanted help. Furnace is done for it, my dryer, my washer, having a problem with our water heater. It's probably about $20,000 worth of damage as well. The amount of water, it just doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. Some asked if federal grants or loans were available, which helped some of them after a similar flood in 2003. Mahoning County Emergency Management Director Dennis O'Hara said there must be widespread destruction. And while we have some structure, some residents that have sustained major damage with wall collapses, it doesn't meet the threshold for us to receive the federal assistance. Boardman's comprised of two major watersheds, Mill Creek and Yellow Creek. Boardman Township Administrator Jason Lurie explained Boardman's future plans for stormwater retention. Boardman has joined Austintown and Canfield to form a storm water utility district. In the near future, every home and business in Boardman will be charged a utility fee. And that goes to a pot of money for stormwater utility infrastructure. And in some cases, unfortunately, the best solution is to relocate and get rid of homes. And if relocating is what it takes, Joe Burton may be fine with that. I'm willing to sell the property back, turn it into a retention pond. I don't care about making anything. I want the problem fixed. No one knew for sure the extent of the damage in Boardman, how many houses or businesses were affected. Was the damage major or minor? The trustees asked that a system be put in place for people to report their damage by either phone or email. When we know what the system is, we'll pass it on.